And though from one of the most southerly points on the English map, we have travelled to the Vitality Stadium. I'm Derek Ray, ready to bring you match commentary. And alongside me is Stuart Robson. I'm looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League coming right up. It's Bournemouth taking on Chelsea. Well, thanks, Derek. The best coach I've played under would always tell us before kickoff, earn the right to play. If you can win your individual battles, outrun your opponent, eventually you'll get the space to show your ability. I'm sure that's being echoed by the coaches here today. And the starting 11 for Bournemouth. Well, in this system, I'm not sure how they're going to pose a threat going forward. The centre forward will certainly struggle to get any support, and there doesn't seem to be any attacking width. And here's how it looks for Chelsea. Kepa is the goalkeeper. As Pini Quetta plays with Ben Chilwell in the fullback positions. Mateo Kovacic plays with N'Golo Conte in the centre of the park. And the idea is to have just the one striker up there trying to pose problems for the opposition. Thank you for attending the game at the Vitality Stadium. Enjoy the match. And now they get the ball rolling. Chilwell. And Golo Conte. This is Thiago Silva. Now, do they mean business on this occasion? And Conte in the vicinity. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. That was miles off target. Well, so many terrific players have come through German youth academies in recent years. One such player as Kai Havertz. Stuart, what do you expect to see from him today? Well, Derek, when he's on form, when he's focused, he's a brilliant runner with the ball. He can take on players, he can go past people with ease, and he's got a great shot on him as well. I'm really looking forward to watching him play today. He has teammates around him. And fed forwards. Kovacic. Well, a bit of a disappointing finish. Still work to do. Oh, blocked it! And that was a very fine read. Chilwell. Must take the lead here. Oh, but he's missed it! How on earth is this still level? Well, I just don't know, Derek. Just a real lack of composure in the end. They should be ahead now. And continues his run. Promising looking ball. And an astute piece of defending.
Counter-attacking very much an option. They need to get bodies back. Chilwell. Could be. Really sound defending. One block after another. And Chelsea have given us away. Uatara. Now can they make something happen? Lerma. Kai Havertz. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? Mateo Kovacic. Kai Havertz. Havertz! There is the goal to open the scoring. Who can say they don't deserve to be in front? Well, as you can see, he beats the defenders so easily with a change of pace, and then it's a decent finish. That's a very good goal, you have to say. Fernandez Chelsea recovering possession well out of play and a Bournemouth throw forthcoming one to cut out really Conte and the cross goes in oh that is a majestic goal volleying home with precision and style superbly done Well, here's the replay, and what a well-delivered cross this is. Perfectly placed, and the finish is clinical. He just makes it look so easy, doesn't he? Chill well. Mateo Kovacic in the centre. Not quite the clearance they were hoping for. And he got to it fairly easily. And he was in the right place to intercept. Well, on the cusp of the half-time interval, and I think it's fair to say they're enjoying this away day. Stuart, what have you made of what you've seen? Well, from an attacking point of view, it's been a very good performance. I really like the way they've got the ball from back to front, then how the forwards have got away from their markers, and the speed of their attacks as well. It's been a really impressive first half. Slipshod passing. Can they take advantage? The referee spotted the infringement, and it will be a free kick in a position of genuine menace.
Can they cover up? Well, it's a wild attempt. He needed something better. Offside, however. Well, you're right. He didn't know it was going to be offside, and that was a shocking miss. Well, three minutes of stoppage time added on here. Well, over the top, but it will go through to the keeper. A bit scruffy with the ball, Kovacic. This is looking threatening. Soranke. Billing. Didn't fall the keeper. Well, could this be the turning point? The fans are certainly hoping so. He's driven in the corner. And still dangerous. Well, that's going to be all for the first half here at the Vitality Stadium. And a really dominant performance so far from Kai Havertz. Not that that comes as a huge surprise. Well, he's looked unstoppable today. Quick, clever, skillful, and he's taken his goals really well. He's been wonderful to watch. So back underway, and an intriguing second half in prospect. Number four, Lewis Cook. Our play stopped. It is a free kick. This looks interesting. Philip Billing. Now with Ryan Christie. A meaty but fair challenge, and it will be a throw-in. Oh, they've lost it. Free kick to Chelsea. Well, he'll be thanking his lucky stars that the referee settled for a verbal warning rather than a booking. Chelsea will get the throw in. And teammates to play it to. Conte, and now with Havertz, he might yet finish, and the keeper more than equal to the task. Now sending it in, immediate priority to clear the danger. Really good high press. Opportunity it is. Well, choosing to chip, and it wasn't so very far away. Well, it was good vision, excellent technique, but not quite the end result it deserved. Solanke. Well, not hard to read that pass. Well, Chelsea have had so much possession, as you can see. They've passed it well, their movement's been good, and they've been well worth their lead. Could get even better here. 
Yes, who knows? Maybe another opportunity in the works for them. Brooks. A really sumptuous ball. Oh, brilliant goalkeeping. And there it is. An almost intuitive piece of finishing. Well, the initial save is a good one, as you can see, but unfortunately, it drops straight to an opponent. A bit unlucky, really. Well, underway again. It's a narrow 2-1 lead as things stand. And he's allowed it to go over the touchline, so a throw-in. Senesi. And that was a very fine read. And beating the defender. That was perfectly timed, and it is going to be a corner. Time for a change then. Well, the crowd are doing their bit. Can they find the equaliser here? It's a short one. Poor pass. The referee correctly decided to play advantage. Take some progress with the ball at his feet. Good looking cross. Oh, blocked it! Havertz. Well, nicely cut out. Now, what can they do with the ball? And the referee blows the whistle. It is a free kick. And time for the change now. Can they take advantage? And nothing positive comes of it, unfortunately. Christie interception to snuff out the danger superb effort to keep it in can he do it? oh right in the nick of time Well, I have to say, these fans have been excellent. They still believe they're going to get back into this. A move of promise on the flank. And will the cross work out for them? And the problem not completely solved. Got to it easily, the keeper. And just losing control of the ball, and it will be a throw-in. And they will make the change now. And continues his run. Oh, breezing past him. And a body in the way. Splendid defending. Time really is of the essence. What can they do from this situation? It's 
So the corner played into the box. Danger averted for now, but it'll be another corner. And they're making a change. Trying to pick out a teammate. Well, he has a flair for the dramatic. Let's give him high marks for that. Yeah, it's always the risk. You can end up looking a bit silly if it doesn't come off. He's having a quick chuckle to himself. He knows that wasn't a good effort. Free kick to Chelsea. Fernandes. Conte. Splendid defending, and it needed to be. Lewis Cook. Oh, he's given the ball away. Sterling. Now Conte. It's a perfect challenge. And good use of advantage. The referee allowing play to continue. Soranke are getting it forward, but they need an equaliser. Oh, brilliant goalkeeping. Time is not on the side. This corner could help the prospects as they look for an equaliser. Delivering it. Well, flinging himself at it. And over it comes. Oh, no end product. They'll repeat the trick. Corner again. And clears his lines. Behind in the game, but now they have a corner. He's done well to full-time men, the referee's whistle, and it's a win for Chelsea. That's the big headline, Stuart. Yes, Derek, there wasn't much in it, to be honest. Really competitive game with chances at both ends, but they probably just about edged it overall and deserve the result in the end. Well, a high-level contribution from Kai Havertz. Stuart, sum up for us what most impressed you about his performance. Well, what more could you ask for? His build-up play was clever, his movement was dynamic, and he scored a couple of goals. What a player he is.